Hello, welcome to Aprende Inglés Ahora podcast. My name is Mr. Peña. I'm your host and your English teacher for today. We're going to be learning about everyday conversations. But before we get started, I want to offer you something for free. If you like what I'm doing here and you want to learn English, grab my 10-day English grammar guide. You can master the basics of English grammar in 10 days. So it'll take you about two weeks. You can get this PDF for free by joining my Patreon using the, down, using the link down below. You don't have to pay anything. There's a free version of Patreon where you can get this link. Just <clears throat> click down below and you'll get it absolutely free. I hope to see you in the community. Now let's get on with today's topic. So, we're diving into the essentials of greetings, introductions, and common expressions for everyday interactions. So let's get started. First off, we have, hello, my name is... Dot, 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 dot. So you could say, hello, my name is Mr. Peña. Next up, if you want to keep it casual, you can go with hi. It's a friendly and informal way to greet someone. Perfect for your buddies or people you're comfortable with. You can say, hi, what's your name? Go ahead and say it with me. Hi, what's your name? Good. Now, let's spice it up a bit. We can say, hey there, what's up? This one adds a touch of familiarity and warmth. Great for friends and colleagues. So the first one is formal. The second ones are, the second and third one is informal. So let's wrap it up. Hello, my name is Mr. Peña. Hi, what's your name? Hey there, what's up? What we just went over are called greetings. This is how you say hello to people. Now the next thing we're gonna do is move on to introductions. We now move on to introductions, a crucial part of making connections. Here's how you can introduce yourself and others. We say hi, no, we say, I'm Mr. Peña, and I am from Florida. If you're watching the video, notice how it's underlined. You can say whatever name, put it in the slot, and then you say, I am from whatever country you were raised in. We can also say, what's your name? So put it all together. I'm Alex, and I'm from Puerto Rico. What's your name? And then when they tell you your name, you say, nice to meet you. And then, so to ask someone's name, that's what you say. Don't forget to respond with, nice to meet you. And now we have our last one, which is, this is Sonia. She is my wife. <laughs> that's not my wife's name, actually, okay? But if you want to introduce somebody else, you say, I'm so-and-so from Nicaragua. And this is Alexa. She is my wife. Or this is Katie. She is my mother. That's how you introduce somebody else. So now let's wrap this up and put it all together. I'm Mr. Peña, and I'm from Florida. Now you go. What's your name? Ah, oh, nice to meet you. This is Sonia. She is my wife. Simple enough. Okay. We now have common expressions. What are you up to? It's a simple way to start a conversation. Like somebody is doing something and you ask, what are you up to? They'll probably be on their phone or on the computer. The second one we say, excuse me. My bad, this 
is what we call an apology. Like if you bump into somebody, oh, sorry, no, or you say, excuse me, my bad. And then the last one is, thank you. I appreciate this. This is a way to have gratitude. Gratitude. So we say, um, I appreciate you doing this for me. And so it's just a way to say thank you. Now I'm going to say it and I'm going to give you a chance to repeat it. What are you up to? Excuse me. My bad. Thank you. I appreciate this. So, a quick overview of today's lesson. We went over greetings, which was, Hello, my name is Mr. Peña. Hi, what's your name? Hi there, what's up? We went over introductions. I'm Mr. Peña, and I'm from Florida. What's your name? Nice to meet you. This is Sonia. Here's my wife. And we went over common expressions. What are you up to? Excuse me, my bad. Thank you. I appreciate this. So those are the three most common phrases in the English language. So if you want to know basic phrases for the English language, you should have a list of greetings, a list of introductions, and a list of common expressions. If you want a list of each of these, about 10 each, then join my Patreon. Click on the link down below and you'll get um, free resource, exclusive content, downloadable resources, and access to my WhatsApp community group. To get, the, to get more content and resources, you will have to um, join the paid version, which is at the point of this video, about 10 to $15 a month. But you're going to have to join soon before the rates go up. However, if you want the English grammar guide that I offered in the beginning of this video, then join the free version. You can join Patreon for free and you'll get access to the grammar guide, no strings attached. I hope to see you in the community. Good luck with your English. This is Mr. Benya's tutoring. Remember to share, comment, like, and subscribe, and I hope to see you soon. Take care and God bless. Bye.